Hello everyone, and welcome to the game Genesis New Alpha 1. Have been refined. We are on a colony ship that I've designed myself. Uh, what is this game? Oh, well, you're going around colonizing the universe. Uh, humanities, you know, you greed, corporate wars, that kind of stuff. Kind of ruined the home world. So now we've designed our own ship, and we're going to go colonize other worlds. Um, ship is staffed with clones. I am a clone. We're all clones. It's like that Alice Cooper song. We're all clones now. So, I've designed this to be as efficient as I can New be. New materials have been refined. And I figured I'd just show off the game. I've, like, no, I've already done a lot of work on it, on this campaign. This is a, uh, they call it a roguelike. Basically, every game you start, it's a random universe, and you just run around, you're supposed to be colonizing, setting up new worlds. Uh, hang on. So, I'm doing something specific in this first view. I've already got a bunch of uh, crew, I've got two species researched that I can actually combine with my people, and I'm just looking now for a specific plant to create the atmosphere for a new species. And, yep, block cheese, that's where it is. Harvester that's where these people are. I mean, where, Glubra, for KOH, potassium hydrate? I think that's called. So I'm gonna go down to the world. Uh, the game is kind of like, it kind of functions like a corridor shooter, roguelike, hybrid. It's fun. You don't fly in space yourself. I mean, your One, ship, you're always zero. on your ship, or Lost a world, or an enemy ship. And it's all a set of corridors. That you... Corridors, chambers, even the planets can be seen as chambers. Because there's a very limited space, you can actually go on them. And I am looking... For... Plant, Glubra... It's gonna be, it's kind of a stone like this, except it's green. On the bottom, you can see my radar. That is a sh an upgrade that I had to unlock. Because usually it was only beyond when there's, oh, there's enemies. Yay, I wanna show them off. Oh, I'm being bit. Yay. Aliens, you wanna pick up all the biomatter you can because that's your health upgrades. Going in my ship because it's just easier to see them. Okay. More. You use biomass to uh, clone people. I'm gonna put down an energy barrier, shield myself, and a turret to turn my ship into a good defensive point. Um, oh no. More of the little blighters. Going back in. There we go. I am loving this radiation gun. X-ray gun. Okay, this is what I'm looking for. I gotta keep my eyes open for the little monsters all around me. There we go. If I want, I can leave now. I've already got what I want. But, might as well. Might as well go ahead and fill up on, I think, blue, lithium. That's what I want. Purples, um, uranium, I think. But I don't need fuel cells yet. So I'm trying to stock up on stuff that I can use. Lithium turns into batteries, turns into those energy barriers to block the enemies. And, oh dear. They're coming. I see you all. Oh, hey. Yeah, X-ray caster, I love this thing so much. I was using the uh, energy machine gun thingy, energy rifle, but that was a bit slower. This is just shredding. All right, it's so nothing to see here until they're here. <laughs> yep, 
just keep at it. You're... Okay. That's completed. I've got one more space. And you want to set up your ship for defense. And you want to set up... But you also want it to be, like, efficient. And I'll show you my layout when I'm done with this planet. And there we go. Alright, return to Mothership. Launch Harvester. There we go. Yay. Oh, there we go. Wanted to pick those up because I think they disappear. Like I said, this game is a very corridor game. It's not really a... It's not really like a freeform space game. And there's my little Robotniks droids for moving everything. Let's see. Did I get a separate one? I know I'd set one up to be built, so I should have three, but I don't know if they're actually... If my guy... Yeah, there we go. There's number three. Uh, let's see. No, well, first... I've got my tractor beam here. This is for taking resources straight out of the debris in space. Which, sure, cable. Gonna need that for stuff too. Oh wait. That was not the world I was on. Oh cool, we've got, oh yeah. Definitely gonna have to go back out for more. But I'm gonna show you, see there's a storage, which it doesn't really matter where you put storage. I've got two of them hooked straight to this. It's deposits that matter. Let me show you real quick. Okay. Turbo lift. Resources deposits collected. are where you put uh, raw resources, unrefined. New and then the refinery is where you put... Is where you go to refine them. Hey, there's my little alien pal. One of them. I put two of them in there to help refine faster. And, of course... Those, the placement of those things is important. You want them right next to your hangar because that's where your robots are going to be. And the robots are just going to manually move stuff back and forth. So, tractor beam. I just wanted all... I wanted all of the, uh, let's say, vulnerable parts of the ship where the aliens can actually come from. All nestled up together in this one area. So, there's the bridge. It's where we go to control the ship, like where we want to go. That back there is a workshop. It's where we go to build weapons. Greenhouse. This is where I want to go. I want to plant... Lubra. Okay. Resources yeah. We'll plant that. New materials have been refined. Keep your crew safe. Heavy alien contact, you say. Anyway. So, that just sent an order to the Robotniks to bring that Gloober plant we just picked up over to the greenhouse. And you can see, there he is. Area bring it to the greenhouse. And that's the only part of the process that isn't efficient because I've got the greenhouses on one side of the ship. And the... All the resource gathering stuff on the other. Yeah, commentating while you're playing is hard because you gotta think in two different oh, no. directions. Biomass, very important. It's okay, guy. Go back to work. I need you to actually plant this thing. Resource acquired. You might be hearing a little resource acquired thing in the background. That's just my ship going about its business while I'm doing my thing. Quarters, don't want. I want the bio lab. She's on the other side of the bio tank. Which I, other than the main resources from the planets and whatnot, I don't think anything else really matters as far as location goes, but. Yeah. Okay. We unlocked crawl. Insufficient biosphere for now. Oh. Oh, hey! That's a promotion. Never mind. That's good. I'll go see what's what in the greenhouse. There we go, that's Glubra. Pretty plant, huh? Nice blue. 
and New materials have been that's refined. the KCL plant I had earlier. HCL, which is Yari. And then there's like three ferns. Yeah. Okay, for oxygen. Resource acquired. Yay. And we're just beaming stuff in, refining it. Okay, bio clone lab. Now we can actually queue this up. Crawl one. Cloning initiated. And Okay, there's the clone tank. It's ready to do the job. It's about to get a little freaky for y'all. I only did it for a little bit, because I wanted to show you the in progress. There's a little clone in progress. Do a little bit more. I thought it would progress a little bit. Resources collected. Yeah, it progressed a little bit. And then finish the job. Which I could have done that all in one shot, but welcome. I thought you might like that. There we go. And there's a new alien, buddy. And I can assign him wherever I want. I'm gonna see if... Because each plant can give you, like... Yeah, two atmosphere. Initiated. Two biosphere. So... Resource acquired. Hey. Yeah, that's one I'm just gonna do all in one shot. There we go, and there's our second one. And I mean, they're mostly human. They've just got a little bit of alien in them. Which helps them exist in other conditions. And like everything... Oh yeah, Zen pool. This boosts the healing rate Resources of your people. Collected. And it seems to be where they go when they're not busy, which is fine by me. Quarters. Crew quarters, design pool, more quarters. I think I can get another thing of quarters in there too. No, it solidified. That happens. But now, let's see workshop. I'll show off the workshop. Resource acquired. Okay, we've got plenty of stuff. So let's see. Defenses for turrets don't have. Can construct two of those while I'm at it. A little bit more energy cells. Processing. And they'll get on to work. These little terminals right here, they're supposed to walk up to them and start typing, and over time it boosts your progress. Uh, let's see. There, it's the bio tank. Resources Reactor. Collected. Bridge. Tractor beam. Now, what am I gonna do? I am going back to the hangar. And I'm gonna assign those two new guys that I just did Job assigned. to the hangar. And if we just wait and watch. Go. See those two green dots? Obviously, those are the guys we just did. And they're running from the Zen Pool all the way over to the hangar with me. And they're going to join up with me as a way team. It's very Star Trek. Meets just about every space fairing. Ooh, that means that's a monster. I think. Yeah, I knew it. And that's either a monster or that's a guy engaging a monster. Okay. So what are we gonna do? Harvester destination set. Launch that. They'll go in without with or without me. I'm gonna join them. And they're gonna be on the planet with me. Here we go. I 
I'd better put this up. Give us somewhere safe to retreat to. Right. Now while they're busy, they're gonna get busy uh, running to, yep, to work. I'm gonna get busy running to the site because sites are very fun. They give you other gear. They give you a lot of different things, including artifacts that you can bring with you on your next runs. Like if you, if I were to lose this, but I were to find the right equipment, I could actually bring some extra stuff to come on. Eighty percent. Almost there. Almost there. One hundred percent. Looks like a suit upgrade. What is? Oh, meta item. Meta item means. Suit upgrade vial increases heavy caliber consuming weapons damage by 5%. Oh boy. <laughs> I just noticed that. Oh shoot. No, no. Okay. Um, again. A meta item is something that you can bring with you into other runs. So, very nice. Always collect biomatter. Always. Biomass. Biomatter, biomass, same thing. Alright, have you guys actually collected any? Yeah. Good, they focus on the plants first. I thought they would. Or I'd hope they would. I'd rather get something. Forget what. No, we are under attack. And now they're coming from outside. And once they're done, once they've filled up the ship, they're going to automatically just run back. And right click to collect something, collect stuff like this. Hold down the right click and it brings it up. Source completed, and we're going to go back again. Friendly fire is not really a thing in this. Might be stuck on the other side of something. Yeah, I think they're all stuck on the other side of that plant, maybe. Yep. There we go. And I think my guys just retreated. No, no. Now they're done. Now the ship's full, so now they're done. There we go. Biomass there, but it's not. Biomass, you use it for different things. Um, mainly for clones, but it's also what you use to heal. It heals like 50 points in a shot, you can see. We've got 5 biomass on this mission. That's what we collected from the planet. Yeah, hostiles, we don't need to worry about them. Okay, real quick, I want to run out want to keep an eye open. At any point during this process, aliens could pop up. When he lifted that, I was watching. It could have, aliens could have popped up. They might pop up when he puts it in the, puts that in the, uh, there we go, in the deposit. So there we go. They might pop up there. They might pop up in the deposit. They might in the refinery, which is why I put this down. You just really want to be keeping an eye out for on your defenses and making sure that the aliens don't get a chance to infest your ship. Which if I'm doing my job right, you're not going to see that happen. While I'm at it, I might want to double check. Ooh. Yep, yeah, that was coming. But I'm not alone anymore, so... Yeah, 
uh, you always want to clear, you want to check these places out too. Because the creatures called lichens could pop up. And those things make your people sick. They can unleash other aliens. I mean, they just, they sit still. But they do all sorts of nastiness. And they grow. And if you're not careful, they will overrun your ship. And then a tractor beam. I might get an alien up here. Or I might get one down here. That's why I got lasers all over the place. And of course I put lasers down. I put an energy barrier down over here. To keep them from getting out. I mean they might still get into the storage. Or into the hangar area. But they won't get into the rest of the ship. Um, now as you saw earlier. They can come out of the plant when you're trying to plant it too. bridge there. Yeah. So let's get another plant down. Okay. Plants. Another glubra. Processing. <laughs> yeah, while I'm at it, if that's where the plants are going to be, then I'll put a couple of shields. Oh, I guess I ran out. Yep, I ran out. Okay. Hold on, a shield over there to keep them in, and a shield and, and right here to keep them from getting out. And that should keep us safe from there. And I've got a guy running around here somewhere. I'm like, yep, there he is. Be he, might be a she. Yep, that's a woman. Materials have been refined. Materials have been refined. And I just thought you might, might like a little bit of a change of pace from Mountain Blade. Obviously, when you see this, you're going to see that there is Mountain Blade, other Mountain Blade vids up already. So, no worries. I'm not actually stopping that series. I'm just occasionally doing other videos to give you guys a change of pace. Bridge. Oh, yeah. Because he sits on the bridge. I've got how many spots? Four? Yeah, I think i got four total spots for my robots. I need... Can we make more? Robot station. Requires three more frameworks. Iron, I think. Anyway, so that's your first look on this channel of Genesis Alpha 1. Uh, let me know what you think. If you like it enough, I'll probably... I'm going to play this, of course. Whether I film it or not, we'll see. I'll probably do a completely new... Well, I mean, I'll run this campaign into the ground because this is a... It's a roguelike. They're meant to be run into the ground. You wait, you fight until you can't fight anymore, and then you just do another run. It's fun to see how bad it can get before the end. So I will see you all next time. Bye.